Why blow himself up at his own funeral? Toy man's last trick. What is that? Flying monkeys. No, no, it's a bomb. That's a dangerous toy. Hey guys, Ben here and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 3 and today we're going to be talking about the second promo for Episode 14 which was just released before the extended promo so there is a few new scenes and I wanted to actually break them down because I didn't see this trailer yesterday so we broke down that other trailer, the link will be in the description below to see that trailer we talk about Laurie Metcalf and her playing Wynn's mum and also some other stuff to do with what's going on in that trailer and what will happen in the episode. But today we're going to be talking about that and also we're going to be talking a bit about the Imra and Kara stuff that's going to be going on in episode 17 which is three episodes later so we've got a while to wait but I have some new news to talk about. So if you do go on to enjoy the video please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any Supergirl videos later this year. Okay so first off we're going to be talking about the episode 14 trailer and this trailer that I played at the start of the video is a shorter trailer but it does showcase some new scenes that weren't in the extended trailers so I felt like I definitely had to apply this into a video considering that it has some more context as to what's going on but we're going to only be going through those new shots and so the first new shot is of Supergirl and she's using a pole of sorts I'm not sure I think she just ripped something out the wall and she's stabbing one of the explosive monkeys that Win actually talks about in the voice overlay in the trailer and this is inside the DEO so this person knows about the DEO because they've sent the toys actually to the DEO so I think this new toy maker the girl that we've seen in the previous trailer and we'll talk a bit about her in a minute I think she definitely knows about Wynn and his work in the DEO but the scene extends and in the background you can see Wynn and you can see Laurie Metcalf who is actually playing Wynn's mum and so that gives us some more context we didn't know as to where Laurie Metcalf's character will actually be we didn't know if she she was going to be fully involved with the stuff at the DEO but it turns out it seems like she's going to be working with Wynn and everyone in the DEO because she's in a DEO black suit and also she's inside so they don't really let any random person go there so she probably has some sort of information that they need in regards to stopping Toy Man, this new Toy Man or in regards to whatever happened with Wynn's dad. The next new shot is a shot of this mystery new toy maker as I've called her and she's making a new toy and this toy it seems to be is rigged with explosives because you can see wires dangling out of it and it's a doll so I think she's going to be using a lot of these different toys in different ways in the episode and as you can see on her name tag it actually says Jacqueline so there is no person in the comics who is linked to the toy man that is called Jacqueline so I think this might be a false identity or it could be just a new character that is totally different and they're just going to make a new toy maker in regards to her so that shot is just extended from the other trailer and we see a look at her face and I'm fairly certain people have been saying that this actress is actually from Grey's Anatomy. So that's really interesting that we're getting more Grey's Anatomy crossovers because if you didn't know, Kyla Lee was actually on that show and it's a great show. I've heard a lot of good things about it. So that's awesome to see that they get to interact with people in the past. That's always a good thing. That's why I get so excited when the Glee actors come on Supergirl or The Flash. And so the final shot of the trailer is just an extended shot of Kara inside that Supergirl life-size action figure box and oh my god I'm just so excited for this scene but anyway so we're going to be actually moving back on to the Imra and Kara stuff and so in episode 17 which is three episodes after we know that there is going to be some sort of feud between Kara and Imra as we've seen from behind the scenes photos but now I have some context as to what's actually going on in the scene and the feud is actually about how to handle pestilence so I'm guessing that with Imra and Kara being at odds. One of them wants to not be nice and probably wants to kill Pestilence and in this case I'm guessing it's actually going to be Imra considering the fact that big spoilers ahead Pestilence in the future or in the present day actually kills Imra's sister and that has been confirmed via the spoiler account so she's gonna want to go tough on them and so the feud comes with Kara not actually wanting to do that. We know that Kara actually wants to save the world killers from themselves 
and so that's going to cause the feud so hopefully that wrapped up some stuff for you guys that is basically it and so at the end of this episode Imra's actually going to leave with Brainiac 5 and Monel's actually going to stay and although I don't think that is going to be the main reason as to why they leave I think it may play a part in that in some ways but anyway guys thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed the video and I will see you guys later goodbye Shut free.